Welcome to the Professor Slots Podcast. I'm your host, Dr. John Friedel, but please call me John. I help slots enthusiasts improve their gambling performance with next level tactics and strategies. Want to accelerate your slots journey, be more profitable, and understand casinos better to take advantage of them? I have over a decade of experience working with slots enthusiasts just like you, so you're in the right place. In case you missed it, on my last episode, I went over where to play and not play slots in a casino and Connecticut slots. I hope you enjoyed listening to my last episode as much as I enjoyed making it for you. Today's episode number 178 includes a review of the slots industry in Delaware later in the episode, but I'll begin for you today with using strategies to get more wins on slots. Want more wins on slots in your local casino? But how? So many slots enthusiasts haven't done this one thing. How hard would you work to win at slots? I don't mean physical effort, although getting up earlier than usual might be necessary, and I don't recommend spending money you don't have, not at all. What I mean is, would you polish off some of your old math skills? Would you change your mind and think differently about something you've always thought was one way, but is instead holding you back? So would you? Is winning at slots important enough to you to try to win? I know you're a hard worker. You're listening to this, aren't you? All settled in to listen to this post, and I'm so glad to have you here. So I'll get right to the point. Winning slot strategies exist. They are not just theories, but repeatable methods to win jackpots more often. They started as ideas indeed, but then I tested them out at my local casinos. I got to seven star status with Caesars Rewards in six weeks. Well, I let them know I'd reached the required tier points, and would they care to invite me into that level? They checked, and by golly, they did. Did I have theories that didn't work? Sure, but I modified them until they did work or never told you about losing strategies because, of course, those approaches wouldn't help you win. Some innovators try to explain how this works. They explain having a hundred ideas, maybe two of them are successful, even revolutionary. That's how innovators find success. If you've been with me for a while and are maybe even taking my course, 30 Days to Play Slot Smarter and Win, you know getting used to my ideas takes some adjustment. The first step is so, so hard. I ask, no, I challenge you to look up from your slot machine. So the first step is to look up, look around. Are you at a winning slot machine? Where is it located in the casino? Is it near to landmarks within the casino? Is it across from the food court at the main intersection of the casino? Where is it relative to other features, landmarks of the casino? The second thing to do is go for a walk at your casino. You'd be surprised how many slots enthusiasts haven't done this. I don't blame them, not really. Aisles are often either curved or have many intersections blocking your way, and it seems like you're lost as soon as you step away from your favorite machine that you always play. But if you are able, go for a walk, get lost, and then get yourself unlost. You're on a slot's journey, and it's not just symbolic. Go for a walk. You'll be amazed by what you see in plain sight. Do you want more wins at slot machines in your casino? How? Well, get to know your casino well. Go for a walk like it's a park. Check out the landmarks. See the sights. You know how you put a lot of time and energy into your slots play for not nearly enough wins? Yeah, I get it. I'm here to help you change that. If you're trying to accelerate your slots momentum, become more profitable, and win more than ever before, I will help you move forward with confidence. Hello, slots enthusiast. It's great to hang out with you again for another Professor Slots podcast. I do this every few days to help you improve your slots performance, leave with your winnings, and ultimately change your life for the better. And hopefully I'm going to change your life a little bit today so you can visit your casinos and play slots smarter. And sometimes the best way we can do that to change slots enthusiasts' lives for the better is when they enter into a business relationship with us. They become a client. They buy our online course. They start getting coaching from us, whatever the case may be, because you have ways to take advantage of your casino, which allows you to impact how much you win and then leave with your winnings. There's a couple ways to improve your slots performance and leave with your winnings. The way I often recommend is to do what's best for you and for your location on your slots journey. I typically recommend that you visit your casino where your only goal is to learn that casino well. Second, to figure out which of my strategies work at your casino because they're counter strategies based on what you learn and observe at a casino you visit often. Those are designed to take advantage of your casino's manipulation methods, which are marketing approaches, and then turn the tables on your casino's plan to get your bankroll from you. If you're trying to improve your slots performance, maybe you feel like Mike. Great, another late night at the casino. I can't keep doing this every night. He tries to convince himself that staying awake this late is going to be worth it. Why isn't this doing better? I mean, I'm working really hard and trying really hard, and all I'm getting is like three bonus rounds on a slot machine that's already taken half my bankroll. I've been doing this every single week for an entire year, and I'm still not even getting any hand pays. How am I supposed to improve if I'm not even getting any traction? 
I love doing this playing slots thing, but when I am looking at these other slots enthusiasts at my casino, they're winning hundreds of dollars, and I should certainly have that by now. I mean, if casinos give wins to other slots enthusiasts, they should certainly give more wins to me, but why don't they? Well, let me finish this play session. Maybe this one will be different, right? Does Mike's story sound like your story? Unfortunately, it's very common. As Professor Slots, I've worked with slots enthusiasts and see this story time and time again. And why is it that some slots players seem to be a magnet for tons of wins and tons of hand pays and W2G jackpots, while other slots enthusiasts barely break even, if that? If it's not based on luck or some behind-the-scenes connection to the casino, what is it? Well, here's the secret. You need an intentionally focused slots plan, and that is what I want to give you in my course, 30 Days to Play Slots Smarter and Win. This process has literally been refined over hundreds of slots enthusiasts and over years of experience as I've been growing winning approaches for my clients at their casinos. We've worked with slots enthusiasts planning a trip to Las Vegas, tackled cruise ship slots, casinos in a lot of states like Ohio, North Carolina, Iowa, Atlantic City, and New Jersey, to tribal casinos in Florida, Oklahoma, and Alabama, fixing loss limit issues as well as staying too long and losing all their winnings, progressive jackpots, advantage play slots for slots enthusiasts who want to grow their performance, get more wins, more comps, more fun, and just need a step-by-step -step plan to do that. This process is the basis of how I've helped my clients generate win after win, and that number is growing very rapidly. People, slots enthusiasts just like yourself, they've gone through this process and they've started at zero wins, zero hand pays, and within six months, some of them are making a living playing slots every month. Improve your slots performance in 30 days or less with my 30 days to play slots smarter and win. You also get three free valuable bonuses, including one month free to my Slots IQ membership group, where you get community support and accountability. Visit ProfessorSlots.com slash 30 days to learn more about the free bonuses, course content, and testimonials from participants. In the next segment of the show, I provide a brief overview of the current state of gambling in the U.S. state, territory, or the federal district, emphasizing the gaming industry of four slots enthusiasts. Let's go over Delaware's gaming industry for playing slots. Delaware Slot Machine Casino Gambling consists of three casinos offering Video Lottery Terminal, VLT, style slot machines remotely controlled off-site by the state lottery. The minimum legal gambling age in Delaware depends upon the gambling activity. For land-based casinos, it's 21. For poker rooms, it's 18 or 21 if alcohol is served. For bingo, the lottery, and paramutual wagering, it's 18. At Delaware's casinos, a minimum bet is one penny. The maximum bet is $2,500. Notably, Delaware has a policy of winner privacy. Gaming terminals fall under this privacy stipulation, so casinos cannot release the names of winners for promotional purposes unless the winner specifies otherwise. Next up is a usually short statement about slot machine private ownership, which I have included in case you live in this U.S. state and are considering owning a slot machine. Here it is. In Delaware, it is legal to privately own slot machines which are 25 years old or older. The Delaware Gaming Commission is Delaware Lottery Games. This state agency is responsible for providing gaming regulations for VLT-style gaming machines and table games. Further, enforcing Delaware's gaming laws is the responsibility of the state's Department of Gaming Enforcement, DGE. In this section, I discuss Delaware gambling establishments. Delaware has three paramutual racetracks with VLT gaming machines offering multiple games of video slots, video blackjack, video poker, and video kino. The largest casino in Delaware is Casino at Delaware Park. The second largest is Bally's Dover. The three casinos in Delaware are Casino at Delaware Park in Wilmington, 37 miles southwest of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Bally's Dover in the state capital, 53 miles south of Wilmington, and Harrington Raceway and Casino, 25 miles south of Dover at the Delaware State Fairgrounds. A casino map is available on my website for this state at professorslots.com de. There are no tribal casinos in Delaware, as this state has no federally recognized tribes. As an alternative to enjoying Delaware slot machine casino gambling, consider exploring casino options in a nearby state. Bordering Delaware is to the north, Pennsylvania, to the northeast, New Jersey, and to the south and west, Maryland. To visit any of my articles on these U.S. states, simply visit ProfessorSlots.com, followed by its two-letter postal designation. For example, my Pennsylvania Slots article is available at ProfessorSlots.com PA. Online gaming for real money gambling, including slots as well as poker and other casino games, exists in Delaware, although an online player must be at least 21 and physically located within the state's borders. See each casino website for links to this gaming option offered by Delaware. Delaware was one of the original states where sports betting was available in 2009. Sports betting is for multiple games of professional and college sporting events. 
Further, to help Delaware compete with casinos in neighboring states, all Delaware casinos offer table games of craps, blackjack, and roulette. The availability of other table games depends upon each casino. The minimum and maximum theoretical payout limits for Delaware's gaming machines are 87% and 95% as an annual average for each machine. Further, games may have a theoretical payout higher than 95% with approval from the director of Delaware Lottery Games. No list is publicly available of which machines the director has given this approval. Delaware's casinos do not directly control the odds of winning on their VLT-style slot machines. Instead, Delaware Lottery Games controls the odds of winning remotely and off-site from the casinos. Monthly return statistics are online at Video Lottery Monthly Proceeds and Distributions at Delaware Lottery Games under the latest entry for monthly proceeds and track data. To calculate a player win percent, divide amount won by amount played for a month, then multiply by 100%. For the latest return statistics, see my article on Delaware's return to player referenced in my Delaware Slot article at professorslots.com de. I'd share that information here, but trying to show charts and graphs on a podcast episode is problematic. Improve your slots performance in 30 days or less with my 30 days to play slot smarter and win. You also get three free valuable bonuses, including one month free to my Slots IQ membership group, where you'll get community support and accountability. Visit professorslots.com slash 30 days to learn more about the free bonuses, course content, and testimonials from participants. The next episode of the Professor Slots podcast will include another slots-related topic and a review of the slots industry in the District of Columbia. For you, I'm making the audio of today's topic from my prior YouTube live stream as a bonus episode, but have limited its distribution. Doing so was a difficult decision to make, but is best for the overall health, well-being, and growth of this podcast. It will be on my Professor Slots app, which is freely available at both app stores for the Apple and Android devices. These bonus episodes, sometimes hours long, include the main episode's topic, but also lots and lots of Slots questions and answers from Slots enthusiasts just like you. Enjoy! That's the end of another great episode of the Professor Slots podcast. Thanks so much for listening. I plan to have the next episode come out very soon for you, where I'll have more amazing content for the show. Until the next episode, have fun, be safe, and make good choices. Bye.